Welcome to Gold Rush and Four Mile. Located in the high desert of northern Nevada, the Cortez Camp has a mining and exploration history going back over 150 years. Barrett became involved in the district in 2006 and announced the Gold Rush discovery in 2011. This is Gold Rush on the eastern flank of the Cortez Mountains. Gold Rush is at the feasibility stage of development with only sparse drilling outside the core of the deposit. Note how few drill holes test the area just to the east and to the north. The Gold Rush resource contains 9.6 million ounces of measured and indicated gold in 31 million tons of material for an average grade of 9.6 grams per ton, as well as 1.9 million inferred ounces at 8.2 grams per ton in 7.3 million tons. The grade shell, shown here in red, encapsulates drill hole intercepts with greater than 5 grams of gold per ton. This is the exploration decline planned to access Gold Rush from the west and below. The deposit itself is roughly 5 kilometers long and 700 meters wide. Here, we're looking to the east. This is the area where the exploration decline may reach the deposit. Looking to the north, we can see that the deposit is contained within a favorable rock unit, with the yellow and blue lines showing the upper and lower surfaces of the favorable stratigraphy. Today, we'd like to highlight the Four Mile Project area, just north of Gold Rush at the head of Four Mile Canyon. Geologically distinct from the Gold Rush deposit, Four Mile highlights the potential of a 13-kilometer corridor of favorable geology. The Mill Canyon stock, a large intrusion north of Gold Rush, is shown here in pink. It also lies just to the east of the Cortez Hills Mine in red. These large intrusions are a common feature of carlin-type deposits. Please also note the extensive area of geochemical anomalism shown in yellow. This anomalism highlights the potential for future discoveries to be made at depth. Here are the drill holes completed at Four Mile since drilling began in 2015. The red disks highlight drilling intercepts, which assayed over 5 grams per ton. This is a long section through those intercepts. We're looking west, with the northern part of Gold Rush on the left. Here are some of the results from drilling thus far. These are early stage results. Please note how widely spaced the drill holes are, with an average of 300 meters between them. Again, the yellow and blue lines define the top and bottom of the favorable host rock unit. For comparison purposes, this magenta cylinder on the right represents the volume of a conceptual target containing 2 to 6 million tons of material. At a grade between 20 and 35 grams per ton, like the intercepts drilled to date at 4 mile, this is the volume it would take to enclose mineralization containing between 1 and 6 million ounces of gold. Spinning the model around, it's clear how much work is left to do at 4 Mile. Drilling is still widely spaced, with lots of room for additional growth. Barrick Exploration hopes that 4 Mile will be the next high-quality asset to support Barrick's long-standing partnership with the communities of Northern Nevada.